What's up guys, how's it going? Mike the Tech here. And in this video, we're unboxing a dock by Qge. This is a Steam Deck dock with lots of really cool features. We'll get into what ports it has and what features it has uh, in the unboxing itself. Now, before we get started, if you're watching this video, chances are you're not subscribed because 99% of you are not subscribed. And that's a pretty bad number. So if you like this one, be sure to click on that sub or a thanks button below. Speaking of thanks, huge shout out to Miss Mo Davis. Thank you so much for being a channel member. If you want to support this channel and get shout outs in videos like this, click on that join button below. So on to the video itself. All right, so here we have the package itself. Let's go ahead and pull the box out, do the big reveal. There it is, oh, upside down. Huge, very nice. We can see this really nice uh, embossed, I guess you call it, design on the box. I liked it a lot. Let's go ahead and get my knife. Let's take a look at the back of the box here. Nothing on the sides, so we'll go ahead and open this up. Let's go ahead and grab my knife real quick. Excuse the dirty knife. Uh, it's been through a lot. <laughs> there we go. Let's go ahead and open it up and see what we've got inside. Right away, we have the device. Not too fancy, just whatever we need, the device and the manual itself. So we'll jump right into it. Here's the user manual. Pretty hefty user manual. Has all the information about the specific ports, I assume. And we're gonna open up the uh, device itself. Here's the dock. Very nice feeling metal. Uh, I always get a little worried about metal uh, with the Steam Deck because the screen, I don't want to get scratched, but it does look like it has these rubber pads here. And that looks like it's gonna protect the Steam Deck pretty well, but uh, yeah, metal does scare me around the screen, but that's all right. And we have the back, we have power, HDMI, display port, gigabit internet, ethernet hit there. USB 3.2 on the side as well, and uh, USB-C as well. So lots of ports to play with here. Here's the bottom of the device with some pads as well. Those rubber grips should do well to keep it in place. Let's go ahead and see what it looks like with the Steam Deck on it. All right, so there's the Steam Deck. Immediately fits well. Feels pretty comfortable at a single angle. It doesn't move uh, very much at all. Here's a look from the side, excuse the dog hair. <laughs> I have multiple dogs, as you probably could tell from the intro, but here's a look at the device with it docked. Very nice. And here's the front. You can see that bezel isn't touching, so we're all right there. And here's the other side. You can see that it does cover some of these intake ports. So it'll be interesting to see if that affects it at all, uh, heat or anything like that. But I guess it doesn't matter too much. Um, but yeah, it is going to cover some of those ports. There is a rubber pad between, so it's probably still getting air. There is some space there, but it is going to block a little bit, I believe. And then we have a nice angled USB-C here. Also metal. Feels pretty nice. Well, that's it for this one. If you have any questions or comments, let me know in the comments section below. I'm gonna try this out for a while and um, see what I think of it in the future. And yeah, if you have any questions that I should look out for or uh, what you want to know about the device, let me know for that follow-up video. Thanks for watching. Peace. Mike the tech, Mike the tech, yeah. Mike the tech, the architect, huh?